we know, it was the Greeks that first did in costume. Margaret Berry never had any formal art training when she was in high school. Instead, she had the freedom and time to be creative with the natural materials found on her family's farm. They discovered, I guess, that beeswax uh, act as a protective coating on their ships. As an adult, she worked in fiber arts before turning to the ancient form of artwork called encaustic, which means to burn in. The process uses beeswax, resin crystals, and pigment as hot paint. The wonderful thing about painting in encaustic is that you can, go, you can do very highly textured work pretty quickly because the wax sets up, and so you can put layer upon layer. Encaustic art is produced in a number of ways. Hot wax can be poured over items and pictures placed on a board, or the wax can be applied to the surface of an object with a brush or other utensil. Because the wax cools quickly, multiple layers can be applied, which, Barry said, gives the pieces a more abstract look. People who want to experiment with encaustic don't have to invest a lot of money in equipment. Empty tuna cans can hold the paint, while discarded griddles and hot pots keep the wax warm. You can use a crock pot to make your medium in, but to keep all your colors, you may want something with a surface um, like this. So if you're in the mood to be creative, give encaustic art a try. For NorfolkDailyNews.com, this is Cheryl Schmeckpepper.